Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Hannah. As always, be sure to subscribe and hit that like button down below. Welcome to another weekend in my life. I just filmed another one of these last week and I wasn't going to do another one for my next video, but Kara and I have our friend Austin visiting us from back home, so we have some fun stuff planned and I just thought it would be fun to film and bring you guys along with me. Um, so it is about eight o'clock. We are gonna start pre-gaming in my apartment here soon and then maybe go to this hotel rooftop bar called The Public and then from there we're probably just gonna go to another bar near our apartment on the Lower East Side. So um, before this we actually went to Electric Lemon which is this rooftop bar in Hudson Yards, Chelsea area and it was really cool. We were there for the sunset and it was stunning views. I didn't really have any time to do an intro before we left to go to Electric Lemon because I actually had a pretty busy day in terms of work. I worked from home today, um, but like I mentioned in my vlog last weekend, most of my team is in um, Paris right now for Paris Fashion Week and so because of the time difference, typically I wake up with a ton of emails that I got from the night before. Um, and I have a lot on my plate kind of as soon as I wake up. And so I try and knock that out as quickly as I can. And then Cara made this reservation for five. So obviously I wanted to make sure I got most of my work done so that I could get ready and go and enjoy myself. And I think I'm probably gonna have some work to do tomorrow, but um, hopefully not that much. So Cara and Austin went next door to get um, like juice and soda and stuff for mixers and then our friends Allie and Will are going to come over here soon and then maybe Will's roommate, we'll see. I'm not quite sure what the group is going to be tonight but it will be a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show you guys my outfit really quickly for the night and then we're going to get going. Okay, so this is my outfit for the night, rocking an all black fit per usual. These are my favorite leather pants that I got last year from Nasty Gal. They have um, a slit on the side, which is really nice because they're a little bit long on me, but this way I can still wear them and kind of fit my shoes underneath them. So then they sort of become the right length. And then this tank top is actually Amanda's. Shout out Amanda. Um, it's from Zara. And then shoes are my favorite Prada Chelsea dupes from Nasty Gal. I wear these all the time. It's actually insanely hot in our apartment right now because it's October 1st and our landlord just turned on the heat, but it's still like 60 degrees outside. So it's really hot in our apartment, but kind of cool outside, but still not cool enough to have, I feel like the heat on as hot as it is. And so Cara and I are really getting used to that and what sucks is that our landlord is the only one who can control the heat so we're not able to control it from the apartment ourselves. Um, so we texted him like multiple times today and we were like, can you please turn it down? And he turned it down a little bit but it's still really hot. And my earrings are my favorite just gold statement kind of hoops from Target. I kind of wanted to shower because my hair is looking a little greasy, but I'm going to kind of go for the slicked back look, I guess you could say. But yeah, this is the look. I wanted to show you guys my bedroom now that my room is actually kind of clean because I did a horrible job of cleaning it for the last vlog and didn't even end up showing it to you guys. But yeah, this is my little room. Um, emphasis on little. As you can see, the bed takes up pretty much the entire um, width of the room. There's like a little sliver right here to kind of squeeze by. Um, I mean, I'm kind of used to it at this point, but whenever people come and visit me, it's something that they have to get used to themselves. And then like I mentioned in last week's vlog, Cara and I have our own bathroom. So I have my own bathroom over there. And then, um, yeah, we have like window units for our AC. And then got this really cool throw pillow from Society6. And then this print I got from Etsy and I kind of coordinated the two. And then I have this nice little bedside table and then this light, um, which I'm sure you guys have seen before because it's very popular and a ton of people have them. 
but um we'll get it to focus yeah she's got this cool little light from amazon you can see it more when the lights are off here i'll show you but yeah just kind of a cool party light vibe i guess you could say and then what's nice is that Kara and I both have our own closets um, because not every bedroom in New York City has a closet. It's actually kind of a decently sized closet as well. I mean, it definitely does not fit all of my clothes. I have storage underneath my bed, um, but it's still a closet at the end of the day. And then we have um, like window panels on our doors, so we have to have like some sort of curtain for privacy um and then i have a full length mirror right here on my wall that i got from ikea that i'm obsessed with and it's a really nice big size but it's still like flat enough to where i can hang it on my wall and it won't take up too much room so yeah this is my room i love it i still have some more decorating that i want to do i think i might hang um something maybe over on this wall we'll see but I need to have room to be able to squeeze by and then I might put floating shelves on this wall right here so then that way I can put like picture frames and stuff up but this is where I'm at right now and I'm really happy with it we have our beautiful guest visiting us for the second time in a month a month a month um, they four. just <laughs> they went and got four uh, double shot espressos from the convenience store next door to make um, some espresso martinis, martinis yeah. so that we can make it through the night. Um, oh, gum, very oh. necessary on a night out. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, we're gonna get some music going and I guess get this pregame started. Hey, we're, wearing, we're basically wearing the same outfit. So is Kara. Jeans are Miss Sky Down. Top is Zara. Shoes, Doug Martens, always. Always. Where did you come from? Uh, Zara. What? Pants? Pants are <laughs> nasty gal. She and my shoes are out. nasty gal. I can't see my Snooze. shoes, but I already showed them in the mirror. Snooze so we're all wearing the same thing, but it's fine. See, by now. Just First time I've worn skinny jeans in like a very long time. They're technically like leather pants. Yeah. 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 <laughs> hey guys, it's Alexandra. I'm here with the girls. <laughs> and we are going to Hotel Chantel. Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. Public. Kara keeps talking. Wait, we're not going to Hotel Chantel? After. After. Are we going to public first? Yeah. Oh. Obviously, I'm not sure of the plans. <laughs> Allie's taking over the vlog. Um, yeah, I guess we're going to the public hotel and then we're gonna go to Hotel Chantal, which is like another hotel and club near us. And yeah, that's the plan for tonight. Okay, hey guys, happy Saturday. It is uh, about 1.30. I just finished getting ready. Didn't vlog at all this morning because we really didn't do anything. Um, we went to Hotel Chantal last night in the Lower East Side and it was really fun. It was like three different stories and every story kind of played different music. And so we went there after we went to the public hotel. And yeah, we had a really great time. So we're gonna go watch the last half of the UGA game right now and then um, probably go walk around maybe the seaport district if we have time and yeah just make the most of the day Kara's in the back um Austin is getting ready or I don't know doing something brushing my teeth Austin's brushing his teeth um so I'll show you guys my outfit really quickly and then we're gonna head out we're gonna go to the Bowery beer garden to watch the second half of the game which we've never been to before so that'll be fun okay this is my outfit I got this like oversized white leather jacket last year from Princess Polly dress I've worn a ton of times it's the lioness uh, like black bodycon dress from Princess Polly as well my chain I wear all the time too. It's from Jewels by Jessica. Shoes, wear these all the time as well. These are from Nasty Gals. So this is a very tried and true outfit for me. But yeah, this is today's look. Hey guys, so it is 
routine haven't updated this vlog pretty much all day and kind of just got some random random footage throughout the day while we were out but we didn't really do much of anything except kind of just walk around we walked to washington square park which was really nice it was a beautiful day out and then we went to zest as always for dinner again and then we're kind of getting like late drinks maybe some appetizers at malibu farms in like the seaport area we were gonna try and go there earlier but we kind of decided that we wanted to come back to the apartment and take a little bit of a nap so we've just been hanging out here for the last hour still in the same outfit and i'm going to wear this um to Malibu Farms and then we're gonna come back, change, pregame some more, and then go out. So yeah, it's been a really good, relaxed day and it's gonna be a fun night. We will see what happens. All right. <coughs> not me coughing up my life on camera. Um. Hey guys, so I obviously don't have much of a voice. Um, I've been like a little bit sick for about a week. Got tested for COVID and it's negative, so I think it's literally just a cold or I don't know, change in seasons, I'm not sure, but it's been getting a little bit worse, so I'm looking to see if I can go and see a doctor this week and get it checked out, but um going to be taking it easy today it is sunday morning last night we didn't go to a bar or anything we just went to um our neighbor joe his friend was having this like rooftop party so we went there for a little bit but not too long and then just kind of came back but dinner at malibu farms in like the seaport district was so nice it's so beautiful down there i'd never really been there before but it's right by the water and it was just really great weather and really nice to see. So, Car and I are gonna be laying low today. I might go to the grocery store and kind of clean the apartment some, but Austin is about to go to the airport and head back to Atlanta. So yeah, slept in really late today, honestly. I slept in the latest I've slept in in a while. I slept until almost like 11, but I didn't go to bed till almost three, so there's that too. But yeah, it's gonna be a good Sunday. We'll miss you. Our favorite and only visitor. <laughs> We'll see you next month. Next month, I'm thinking November, the second weekend. Love to see it. Yeah. All right, eating my tried and true breakfast. Well, it's basically lunch at this point. More like brunch, I guess. It's like 12, 10. Um, but yeah, I've been eating this like every day for breakfast. I'm doing a load of laundry currently and then I'm gonna clean my room up some and head to Zara to return some clothes that don't fit. So that's kind of my plan as of right now. Okay, so I just picked up some sushi for an early dinner. It's very much like me to complain about spending money but then to continue to go out and spend it but I was in no mood to cook and also I don't have that much food in my fridge I need to go grocery shopping tomorrow but I just got this dinner bento box from this sushi restaurant down the street from me on Broom Street and it's so good I've had their lunch special before but this is their dinner bento box and it looks amazing I got the tuna avocado roll and then the salmon teriyaki and it comes with an egg roll some seaweed salad and I'm not sure what that is but I'm excited to try it and then I am currently watching the Britney versus Spears Netflix documentary and it's super fascinating a lot more has come out like since um, I'd say like fall of 2020 so it's very up-to-date and it's really interesting I'm learning a lot and yeah I definitely highly recommend uh, watching it I watched a ABC special that was on Hulu like a few months back but this I feel like is a lot better um, it just has more to it and is I'd say more well done in my opinion but both of the documentaries were really good this just came out on Netflix recently and I've heard a lot of really good things about it did some laundry I had to wash my sheets those are currently drying um, so yeah I think I am in for the night um, I'm going to eat this and I need to do a little bit of work as well 
Hello friends, so it is a little bit after 10 o'clock on Sunday night. I didn't get much footage today because I really didn't do much of anything. It was a very relaxing Sunday, which was much needed because woke up not feeling that great. I'm feeling a little bit better. Um, I think the Mucinex and stuff that I've been taking has been helping, which is nice. And yeah, I kind of just watched some TV, caught up on a few of my favorite shows, and then I watched The Guilty on Netflix with Jake Gyllenhaal. It just came out on Friday, and if you have not watched it, <laughs> bless you. <laughs> bless you. Um, if you have not watched it, it's on Netflix with Jake Gyllenhaal. It's so good. Definitely like more of like a thriller kind of a movie. But um, he's phenomenal in it, and it's honestly, it's like kind of sad, but still like really good at the same time. Um, there's like a lot to it. So definitely would recommend watching that. I watched that today, and then um, the Britney Spears documentary, and then Cara and I finished it off with an episode of Real Housewives of Salt Lake City. So this week I'm going to be mostly working from home yet again. I'm probably gonna be in the showroom one day this week, but I'm excited because I'm going on a couple of dates this week. <laughs> um, so that's really exciting. Getting back out there, I guess you could say. Um, I had like a horrible date experience a few weeks ago and that has kind of been permanently ingrained in my brain and I'm a little bit nervous after that whole experience but feeling optimistic um so yeah that's exciting and something to definitely look forward to but other than that just gonna be a normal week um but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video I had a lot of fun vlogging once again over the weekend so as always be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys again next time. Bye.